about futures? Futures are down across the Dow and the S&P 500 this morning, a day after a Chinese AI tool sank some of the biggest tech stocks on the market. DeepSeek skyrocketed to the top of U.S. App Store charts on Monday. That program contributing to NVIDIA losing a record $590 billion in market value in a single day alone and plunging American tech companies across the board. News Nation's Ryan Bass has more for us this morning. Ryan, what do we need to know about DeepSeek and why did it tank so many stocks? So DeepSeek Marquee is basically China's answer to chat GPT and it seemingly does a lot more with less here. And you know, what's really got the US tech industry on edge here is the fact that the fear China may have caught up or even surpassed us in the AI arms race here while allegedly doing so with much less money, chips, and energy. DeepSeek isn't new, by the way. It's been around since 2023, and it operates a lot like OpenAI's ChatGPT, answering questions and generating text based on a prompt you put in. But they dropped their latest large language model, R1, last week, and the AI behind it is already outpacing some of the top U.S. models, which skyrocketed the platform to the number one spot on the Apple App Store over the weekend. In response, tech stocks took a beating yesterday, rattling Silicon Valley. NVIDIA, the AI chip giant, plunged more than 17%, wiping out nearly $600 billion in market value, the biggest one-day loss ever for a U.S. company, with investors starting to worry that advanced AI models might not need NVIDIA's chips after all. Microsoft, Alphabet, which is Google's parent company, the NASDAQ, S&P 500, they all took hits as well. Dow Jones market data said the tech stock tanking wiped out some $1 trillion from the stock market's value. Now, that came after DeepSeek revealed that it had built its chatbot for just $5.6 million, way cheaper than the hundreds of millions of dollars that U.S. companies are spending on AI. So what does this mean for the future of artificial intelligence and the race really here between China and America? We asked Dev Nag. He's an ex-Google engineer and AI startup CEO who called it our Sputnik AI moment, basically likening it much to the 1957 space race launch. The great thing about America is that we always rise to the occasion. We always have before. I think we will here as well. This is a great uh, catalyst for us to really like, you know, unify and push forward. I think Stargate happened at the exact right time. And projects like that, large commitments of talent and capital to go win the AI race, I think are going to be necessary for us in the future. I think it's a race that we're going to win. Now, the Stargate project that Dev had mentioned there is a huge push that was announced by President Trump really in the first couple of days of his presidency to make the U.S. a leader in AI with plans to invest up to $500 billion. By the way, President Trump did comment on deep stake and uh, the tech industry crashing here in the stock market. He said that it is a wake-up call, Marky, for U.S. tech giants. Yeah, fascinating that it's been around for as long as it has, and most of us just hearing about it for the first time yesterday uh, and all the market panic it's causing. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.